Tennessee school and playing collegiate basketball, very difficult to do. But one Florida A&M Rattler is doing just that. Senior Brendan Miles is the only HBCU basketball player in the country in a pharmacy program. Lori Bearing caught up with him, and Brendan tells her while it's possible, it hasn't always been easy. Being a college athlete isn't easy. Being a college athlete in a healthcare major is even harder. Florida A&M senior Brendan Miles first took an interest in healthcare when he was 10 due to a rheumatoid condition. I had to uh, take some medicine, a lot of medicine for it because it could actually develop into cancer later. So um, I just thought, took that experience and I uh, used it to uh, apply to what I want to do to help other people when they have problems with medicine. He's healthy now and his interest has become a hopeful career in pharmacy. My dad's uncle, he's a, um, he's a pharmacist and I saw what he was doing. I, I just enjoyed it and he let me experience it. Um, he did, he's in the industry part of it. So um, honestly, that was what, what called me. I never looked back. I just kept going. He knows a thing or two on how to keep going. Playing ball and being in pharmacy school isn't easy. Constantly, every single day, studying, and then you got to come out here and practice you know, after being up late at night, maybe 2 or 3 in the morning, trying to uh, come out here and play your hardest at practice. Um, it's just tough. Tough, but something Miles wants to be a testament to for others, that it is possible. You can do whatever you put your mind to, and honestly, uh, I knew what to expect. Now, I knew that it was going to be hard, but you gotta, you gotta have a mental, be disciplined. You gotta have the right mental to be able to do something like that. A strong mental mindset that Miles definitely has. In Tallahassee, Lori Beering, ABC 27. Brendan's basketball career with FAMU wraps up this Thursday night when the Rattlers travel to Bethune-Cookman. He has two years left of pharmacy school. The road to a conference tournament championship begins tonight for the Valdosta State men's basketball team. The nationally ninth-ranked Blazers host Montevallo in the Gulf South quarterfinals. A win would advance them to Saturday's semifinals. That game tipping off tonight at 7 o'clock in Valdosta at the Complex. The women are at Union. Stay with us. We'll have more news and weather 